what is in a song anyways? It's when you're listening to songs on the radio, on Spotify, on Apple Music, whatever platform you listen to, what are you listening to? Why are they so catchy? Why do you like them? What is in a song? Great news, I got my bike back. It's been in storage since winter actually at my old workplace and uh, I'm really excited to take it out for a first time spring ride. This is not a children's bike. It is an adult bike. I made sure that when I purchased it. However, it does look like a children's bike. Uh, somewhat embarrassed every time I drive it. And there's this thing in the middle here, this thing, I'm constantly afraid that it's gonna snap and I'm gonna fold in half. There are three main things in a song and I'm gonna go through those things to tell you and hopefully you'll notice those things next time you listen to your favorite song. The three things are, we have a chord progression. This chord progression lasts the whole way through the song. The next part we have is the melody. The melody is by far the most important part to the song. The melody lasts completely throughout the song. And the last part we have to the song are the lyrics. And the lyrics also last completely throughout the song. Now there are some songs like instrumentals that don't have any lyrics, but what I'm gonna be looking at today are only lyrics based songs. So what are all three? We have the chord progression. In pop music, there are not many chord progressions that are actually used. If you go to the top 40 charts right now and listen to all the songs, I can almost guarantee most of them follow the exact same chord progression structure. A chord progression is just a series of chords that make up the sound of the song. Oh. Okay, I found this on the web for chord segmenting. Take a look. Uh, Siri, I wasn't talking to you. There's a structure called the one, four, five. I'm gonna play you four songs that follow the exact same chord progression that are in the top 40 right now. Fell in love, not knowing what it was. Swim every ocean, just to be with you. Cause I played it cool and I was scared of letting go. I'm done. Young, dumb, and broke. Young, dumb, broke high school kids. All those songs are following the one, four, five, and added sixth chord progression structure. Now, they all sound very different, and that's because of the melody, not the chord progression. The melody is really what separates every song from each other and what makes every song distinct. Melodies are copyrighted, chord progressions are not. If you were to copyright the chord progression, one, four, five, with the added sixth, you would only have probably five songs on the planet Earth. We are currently in West Berlin. After the Second World War, Germany was split into two halves, East and West. The East was controlled by the Soviets and the West was controlled by the British, the French and the Americans. But in Berlin, it was, which was in the east of Germany, was also split in two, East Berlin and West Berlin. Currently, we are in West Berlin, and I'm just about to pass into East Berlin. So right here is the split between east and west. This brick road going up signifies where the Berlin Wall actually was placed. So right here, if you can imagine, down the street there was a massive wall three meters tall splitting east and west okay so let's take those songs for example i switched my shirt the melody sits right on top of the chord progression and what i mean by sitting right on top is you have the bass layer which is your chord progression for example in Perfect by Ed Sheeran, the chord progression goes like. 
that is the bass layer. That goes out through most of the whole song, but the song sounds catchy and it pulls you in because of the melody, not the chord progression. The melody is da 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 and if you put that on the chord progression, it makes a nice sounding song. Da 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 So now you have two parts to a song. The third part is the lyrics. Baby, just die right in. The lyrics and the melody and the chord progression in the song work perfectly together. And there are a couple things happening in the lyrics of those lines. He's using imagery and he has a rhyme. Okay, busking day two. I'm not surprised that this spot that I showed you yesterday is full again. It's basically like winning the lottery but instead of winning like 60 million, you get like 200 euros instead, but it's not about the money. I'll probably go to the same spot I did yesterday because it's still pretty good, and I'm almost there and I'll set up. my number one supporter so <laughs> thanks <Yeah>. guys <laughs> When you say 